Alright, and welcome back to Victoria 3, where it's time to get things moving. I'm fifth in the world, I'm starting to educate my people, going to the light of assembly, but I need to get up to number one, and I need to be you know, ready to have maximum health institution. I mean... I don't having a war between each other. I wonder what would happen if I was to like try and invade these guys. I always go to the army one rather than diplomatic. Uh dun 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 dun. It's a diplomatic play, isn't it? Conquer states. You'd have Athelene in it. They may join the might remain. Yeah. It's mostly desert, but it's another 100,000 people. Alright, we're currently boosting up our coal. Got a bureaucracy. How much of it? Probably about time to start declaring interest and think about some colonization. Might be a bit late out the kind of the gate for that. Do we have colonization as a tech? I think it's spread to us. Yes, we have colonization. We'd need to switch our laws to colonization, and I think that's probably a good thing to do. They currently have 40 brigades. If we mobilize, the Arabia HQ, I think we should be in good place. Have you advanced on that front? This is an Arabian Samara revolt. Okay. We will support those guys, because, you yeah, know, we might be able to get them to join our empire diplomatically. The government is already nicely reformed. We've got 33 buildings in the building thing, so I should stop adding more buildings. I think this might kill... Light of Assembly. Alright, we'll kill Light of Assembly. Oh, I wasn't actually in that screen. And we'll go for calling exploitation. We're not nice people. We're an empire. We'll just drop another seventh. Guess we might have a bureaucratic shortfall and colonization code then. Which I can kind of see. Build a few of these knocking around the place. That'll increase my bureaucracy, and I might move them up to the top. I know I just said I'm not going to stop building anything, but these things are fast. It'll be fine. We need more convoys as well. It means we need better ports. No one good this back. Oh, did they just... They just gave in. Look at that. They knew what was going to be for them. They knew that. Okay, I couldn't rule the bandit, which is causing a few issues. 
Let the bureaucracy start incorporating them. What issues have you brought with you? You're in turmoil. Unproductive productive tears routes, need convoys. Other than that. You just allowed livestock livestock. For fabric and meat, which is very low. Yep, those are both good enough thing. Groceries, what does grocery fact we need? Right there. That takes liquor. Uh, so that's not what I'm wanting. What else can you build? Textile mills, and we've reduced the price of textile down. God, you guys will be struggling unless we get something we need. Put any coal. That textile mill should kick in now. We'll whack a couple of food entries down here. They're already massive over the infrastructure though. Hopefully we can fix that by the time we get there. Good restorations. Okay. Oh, we'll take Tripolina, do they like us? Emergency relief. Cyprus will get some more mi migration attraction. This means we're still at war with that I will have ended now. Everyone's disappearing off to Guatemala, apparently. Let's get these ports up, shall we? Getting trade going is much more important than anything else I've got on this list. That was the space part, not the old key. How are we going to be in a little bit of a... Unrecognized regional power. How much of them I could eat up? Climbing into this place for overview. 1,000 populations, another million GDP. Them. Oh, that's a civil war, right? Yep, probably medical degrees, never level of health. So, we're hopefully moving towards that. Our bureaucracy should be coming online at some point. Oh, there's a bunch of mobilization going on here. You're talking Algeria. That's the opposite side here. Oh, France is well and truly into Algeria. Dear Clay, I would like to make France an ally. 
Mine's 39. Oh, it's just got, it's mostly our notoriety level. Alright, let's just burn through a load of this stuff and try to get some colonization going. We've got the army to support it. Ooh, that's exactly what we needed. Central Archive. That'd be great. I think that's exactly what we need to get the next level of healthcare up. Okay, okay, okay. I remember what I'm doing. Oh no, they're captured of raw, aren't they? Atmospheric engine, this would spike tool production price. Would give us more coal. Spike tools and coal. Would give us more iron. By building a load more coal mines. Generally, we just got a lot more productive there. We can go for soil of rich farming on the millet farms. And on that, that will increase more fertilizer, but that'll be good because we're now using more fertilizer. So we need tool factories, I think, next, because I think I'm about to majorly spike the price of tools in my country. I need more armed in factories. Russia, a stick in Weimar, and all that. Oh, they got me closer. Probably Germany. And put the input. Okay. That would hurt the local governors. Hurt our exports a little bit, but increase our imports. Colonial exploration. Logistics. Right, laws. Okay, we need to... Yeah, well, can't go up to level one. I think I do need that extra law. for the police state. I know we're hurting bureaucracy but I can fix that. And I think I am just going to have to go crazy on the old um, this one isn't it? Government administration. Let's... Oh, I'm going to stop building stuff. No, no, I'm not. Never. Probably going to need a new paper mill after all this. I wrote a few arms industries and stuff like that. Eh, doesn't hurt. Let's fish that coal mine off. Right, the bureaucratic expansion continues. I desperately need railways as well. Alright. People are not having full rights. Yep, yeah, they fairly got their thing. Oh, that was like engine was completed. Five years of improved the throughput. What would that get us towards trains then? Minimize that for a second. 
Oh, railways are in sight. Let's get the boost towards the railways because I do need those. I think I could feel it. Nearly half the way towards the railways. That was good. GDP is starting that metal uh, meteoric rise. Realize it's going to be a bureaucratic shortfall. It's all good. Coffee is very expensive. Establish a colony though. Cannot reach, cannot reach. We can reach there, but not there. I suppose there's no sewage canal, is there? So this will probably cause a dip in our income. But will give us a chance to move into coffee plantations and stuff like that. Great Britain has got pretty much all this locked down. We can have a go at competing against Great Britain. We've got the money reserves. Right, so you will need a port. Which of course I have to move to the top. I wish there was a pop up that told you when you like, started a colony like this. I'm putting a racket sulfur mine and a fishing wharf down here. It's not exactly the use of colonies, but. It gets me on the map. Which just the base for Africa at the moment. Ooh, nitroglycerine. Now, do I have anything in the way of explosive production? Die. Like clippers, apparently, I'm doing really well on. Coal is just still expensive. We need explosives. Can we build explosive factories? Munition plants. Looking for the one that's got a good amount of population. Bulgaria. Welcome to the world of munitions. Also, I know what I'm trying to doing, because I noticed was drip, dropping down that list of um, great powers. That's 55. We have a dedicated police force. So now we can go up a level in that, up a level in that. I'm hoping that our bureaucratic increase will be able to eat that. We've got high tensions in the nations we're invading. Let's not call it anything else than what it is. And we definitely need tools. We really should do some other tools. Right in the centre, where I'm blind. Just the tool workshop produce. 80. That should be okay.
I'll probably bring this munition, put one or two of these munition plants up. Just so I can continue to modernize. You see how tech is causing my GDP to skyrocket. Import of trade goods has been cancelled. Got loads of states in turmoil. What's causing radicals? I know what a standing is living is. I'm trying to figure out what's causing my radicals. Unfilled political movement demands. They want me to end colonization. Just lost the booth in building. How long until we get? I can run this for another 110 days. It'll give me access to this place down here, which gives me coffee. But my people are really against colonization. Dropping down, the radicalism is dropping slowly. It's got low support, but it is ticking up the radicals. Okay, the radicals is leveling off now. The police force is probably kicking in. Yeah, we're building up the police force, which is reducing those guys. I'd like to get like a quarter of my country is radical. Just realists. I'll keep boosting the industrialists. I'd really like to get the local governments down to 25%. Alright. So. Port. Then we want a couple of banana plantations. Double coffee plantations. Just make this into a really productive colony. Go for another election. The Conservatives are doing very well in the polls. Need to move that port up to the top, don't I? Also, I if I should go for more construction centres because I got used to having those 50. Transportation is going up. Mine's down for momentum. Freedom of Accord Party. 10% momentum. This should hopefully hurt. Conservative, probably not enough to reduce the stop and getting to government. What are we doing with tools and stuff like that? Explosives are incredibly expensive. But I need to get back on this bureaucratic expansion as well. Let's check my digits PC. That should be okay. They all they all got votes, they all should be in go government. <laughs> degree cost increases. percent chance of life safe fair why is there in the capitalist pool in this menu here isn't it I know someone told me there's a better way of doing this but I'm old and stuck in my um, ways
the economy. Budgets. Alright, yeah. Let's try for Lucy for that. Try and get those capitalists. Blocking, unless it's going to cause me to have a fight. Nope, no one's going to rebel over that. Gonna fight in the bureaucratic hall. Excellent. Now we definitely need railways. Still on a free reform, that's fine. Railways have sought my transportation urge and allow me to turn these places into something awesome. We're infamous now. In Persia, it's only got 65 battalions. That's like bringing them into our market. Certain their treasury. Is it everyone okay? Persia, Persia and Russia wouldn't like that. The good chance they would join. We will keep an eye on this. Is the basic matter. We will mobilize. Arabia HQ. And the Anatolia HQ. I'm going to keep a sharp eye on this. Makes the industrial smart happier. We still got the cash to eat through this. Ah, uh, Russia. That's in terms of our treasury. Russia brings. There's a power position of 1700. 1300 plus Persia. Now we're going to have to back down. It'll only cost me. Let's play income. That's painful but worth it. Definitely can't do the expansion now. It was worth a go. Uh, Sultans will be done. We're losing radicals at a steady rate now. Oh, we can probably look at increasing our um, bureaucracy through a simple building change. The nice filing system would cost a 22k because it would spike the cost of paper. Let's finish these two paper mills. if it's still expensive on our market. Did we build those munition factories or are they not finished yet? Like right, those munition factories need to move up the list.
How much stuff I want to build? I think fine. I can eat 10% of authority. Postal savings. We can save huge amounts of cash now. Power the purse. How is our colonization work going? They're nearly about to eat another area. Place so fair. That's pretty much he sorted out our costings straight off. We can move to wealth voting. That was right. Oh no, that would, that would cause the landowners to revolt. The landowners are still 28% of my government. Okay, I could go for a secret police. A 25% chance it would not cause too much problems and it would help reduce these radicals quite nicely. Well, they want agrarianism back. Big style. Definitely secret police. I always go with my incorporation. Ah, excellent. Two weeks and I've got these guys in as well. Now they'll pay taxes. Okay, a devout stand-up. He is an abolitionist, alright. Ignore it. He's hated, but okay, they're moving against Egypt. They want to create a treaty port. In Egypt could be another good target. Division agriculture. Migration attraction. Train lower Egypt. Yes, we'll accept a diplomatic plan. Please mobilize the Arabian HQ. Got 124 on there, we're gonna need more than that. France basically just wants us here as their um, Right, we got 97, we don't need anyone else. Supporting British are supporting the Egyptians, Greece and Austria. Well we got the buffer between us and Africa, Africa Austria, don't we? Oh no, we need to all right, yep. Let's activate. Oh, these guys will have something as well. Okay, we're gonna have to move. Use to that front. I 
any other random fronts that are popping up? Actually, I want you guys to appear on defend fronts. Apparently I'm about to get myself to a major war. And we just got better with Anything quick we can pick up from the military. Field works. You and your 10 battalion. We need to bring in our conscripts. It's looking like it's going to be war. I think we can smash through Egypt and uh, Greece quite quickly. Right. France, Russia. And the Ottoman Empire versus Egypt, Austria, Greece, Great Britain. Alright, so I, I thought Russia was on their side. I'm actually feeling a lot more confident about this now. They've only got 10 brigades on there. We've got 80. We should be able to knock Greece out quite quickly. Advancing, oh no, they're, they're holding us nicely. They got much better offense than we've got. I've got no idea why we got defeated there. This guy apparently knows his, knows his way around a lot better. We're going to land here. Looks like France has got a front. Canaries could be useful. Great Britain is fighting the French here. We are advancing on Athens. It's Athens, doesn't it? Attica. British troops will be a lot better than ours. Egypt is f collapsing a bit quicker than we are. Information age. Now, they've got enough to worry about. I'd rather have the intelligence GT rather than the industrialists. So the local government is surging back with this war. That has so many funds to manage. Like 200,000 people dead already. What are you doing up here? Hopefully we'll get some... Good stuff back off, off this. I'm wondering if I need to bring in the conscripts. This is the biggest war I've been involved in, so. Let's conscripts and parade brigades in. Oh, they've defeated them, they're pulling it back.
brought Tripoli into this war. We have not. British are doing a good job of stopping our troops. We're going to be overwhelming the Austrians. And here we're just holding the line. My plan to knock... Uh, out the wars failed because well guess what the British are here they are falling quicker than we are though just need to make a break for on the lines down here yeah that's a good chunk of the world that's at war with each other Three hundred thousand dead. Oh, at least France is France started this. At least France is getting in on this. Yeah, she's trying to smash into Austria from this side. If they can get to Vienna, though, things will go a lot better. Oh, we've got minus thirteen on this flank. This flank is even, which so is a bit worrying. The Russians are about to crush Austria up here. Oh, Egypt's advancing into my territory. I definitely need to mobilize more troops. Yeah, everyone out. So reduce the amount we're losing cash. Oh. The French are down here to help us. I will take the increased. Okay, this needs a fill. Counterintelligence forces. My strength, yeah. Obviously, our forces. Yeah. Those raggles are increasing. I might need to bring migration controls back in. Because that's what they're wanting. That looks like they're burning down their colony. Which is a big boo. Ooh, I don't like how that's slipping. Like, even the Greeks are... Uh, Defeating me now. I have to take a risk. Move troops on different fronts. Conflicts are activating. As far as you know, you don't have a choice where the conflicts go. They just get like whacked into places. Okay, so this is swinging back in my way with the arrival of the 50 brigades. I'd like to attack you to attack the British with more than 10 units then. British are holding Greece. We are losing to the Egyptians. French are doing quite well. There's a chance of French breakthrough into Austria. Austria. Is Prussia in this war? Or is this a completely separate war? I'm not sure why Prussia is getting in on this, but they're not part of this. This must be a complete separate war between the Prussians and the Austrians. Which is drawing off 200 Austrian brigades.
Good works. Army defense increase. We'll go for triage. I don't like the number of casualties we're taking. 172,000 dead. 63,000 wounded. Everyone will remember the War of 1857. Which we are losing. Brand breakthrough. We can knock Austria out of the war. Then we can swing everyone down to this force. This look like they've broken free. Massive number of turmoil. 800,000 of Yeah. We'll see what this does, and then we'll have to see what we can do to... People are being fired. It's mostly decreasing standing of living. about to go into debt as well. Look, when I analyze you, France, let's just pause all construction. Just to stop us from spiraling too far into debt. They're advancing through there. We're slowly wearing the Greeks down. Looks like the British forces have disappeared. Makes me worry where the British forces have gone. We're retaking the land they've conquered in Egypt. We've finally made an advance into Greek territory. Right, Austria's capitulated. Which means there's now 304 brigades bunching into Greece. Looks like they've readjusted that slightly. Uncanny disappearance. You know what? I'm not the nice guy. Go on, smash the Greek forces. Like, where the British are, we... We do lose. But... The Greeks are, they're mobilized, but they're not able to stop us. Come oh, on, we're taking good swathes of um, Greece now. We can get Greece out. Egypt doesn't really stand much of a chance. And the French are advancing. There we go. There goes Greece. And there goes the game. Uh, one second. Alright. So, we've reloaded. Austria is out. Greece will be out soon. Oh, it doesn't look like it's too much. We're about to march into Athens. And not Greece out of the war. Now hopefully we can focus on smashing our way through into Egypt. There goes Greece. Ah oh, yeah, we lost only a few seconds. Now the Egyptians are facing the full might of the Alliance.
An action coming. Oh, the great molasses flood. Uh, I can't afford any more magical pops. Not until these secret policemen start appearing. We go massively on the law enforcement. Let's start building up the law enforcement. Remember, people, the police start to protect you, there's, there's a protect the institution. My actual politics are way more left than I play in games. Yeah, Egypt is starting to be crushed now. We're bringing in much larger forces. They've done well. But there's nothing they can do against 360 brigades and three of the world's superpowers. I'm just hoping once my army goes down, look how burned out this land is. Palestine is not going to be doing much for a while. Right, advance this front. We're running low on time before France gets war weary down to this wall. Hopefully, you guys will arrive in the next few days. Luckily, Cairo is only here. Can we even win this battle? We need to bring the bigger forces to bear. That's as victorious. Go to full speed. I don't think we're going to win this one. I think I have to spend a little bit of time. There it goes. Yeah, Russia had to capitulate. Fifty one eight six percent of the vote. I'm gonna have to kick the industrious out of the party. Who's angry? Well, if you weren't angry with me, you'd be in government. Just get this secret police going. Lord, you want me to fall into revolution or something? Send more than two brigades against Egypt at the same time. Ridiculous, we've got 400 brigades, but we don't seem to be able to push it in. Get the water tube boiler. We, we, we just send a few troops in at a time into Egypt. Pistons out. Maybe that will help. It should just be me. Me and France against Egypt. But hopefully, Egyptians will stop winning any of these battles. Central banking's unlocked. Axe 
to the dive works. Let's start boosting the trade unions. Right, France is finally smashing through. Come on. Saving the game and thinking about it. Uh, I think we got another crush. Oh no, we got that. And there's another crush. Honestly, I've ended my video anyway. Not liking this war, is it? We'll see what happens next time. I'll see you then.